Namaste, Soul Tribe, Spiritual Healer, back to give you guys another message. This message is going to be for the sign of Leo. Hi, Leo. Hope you guys are all doing well. I pulled some energy for you guys, Leo, and um, today I, I'm doing something different. Um, instead of pulling only three oracle messages for you guys, I'm going to actually pull six because I'm going to pull three oracle messages from the Moonology Oracle deck, and then I'm going to pull three more oracle messages I'm from the Mystical Moments um, Oracle deck. Okay, guys? And, um, yeah, I figured I'd give you guys some more um, messages with these beautiful, beautiful Oracle um, cards because they give you um, different messages than the regular tarot. Okay, guys? Okay, Leo. So I pulled some energy for you guys, as always. And um, what I'm seeing here is that you guys are transitioning, Leos. You guys are moving away from situations and moving um, in new directions. That's what I just heard. Okay, and you guys are um, no longer going to be juggling your pentacles, no longer juggling um, your finances, or no longer juggling a decision because you guys are moving forward. You guys, um, some of you guys might be receiving um, inheritances or from loved ones because the inheritance card is here, or you guys have um, inherited spiritual gifts because an inheritance could be money and inheritance could be spiritual gifts, okay? So this is what I'm seeing here. Good times are coming for you guys, Leo. You guys are going to be establishing a new family home, probably moving out on your own or just establishing a new home somewhere else. You guys are buying homes or houses because um, the Ten of Cups is here, guys, and you guys are going to be really, really happy in your new homes. And um, you guys have change of plans here moving forward. You guys are changing plans, like I said already before. You guys are moving forward into different directions, different adventures. Um, taking on new spiritual energies and um, just being enlightened spiritually. You guys, some of you guys are going into new businesses, spiritual businesses, practices. Some of you guys just starting new businesses all together. That's beautiful. Good job, Leo. And um, yeah, you guys are having a change of plans. You guys are no longer juggling. Okay, let me give you your first Oracle card that came out for you guys with the Moonology deck. Okay, and then... Um, We'll go from this one to the other one behind, underneath it because I'm just going to clarify with the Mystical Moments Oracle Oracle cards. Okay, guys? So I'm trying something different. I hope you guys like it. Your first Oracle card with the Moonology Oracle deck, Leo. It says, a win-win outcome is forecasted. Full moon in Libra. You guys could be dealing with a Libra and you don't have to be. This is just the energy that this card is, is giving me. And um, you guys uh, are... Starting new projects, you guys are starting new things, businesses and, and adventures, moving forward, getting purchasing new homes. But spirits is trying to tell you that whatever decision you make, it's going to be a win-win outcome for you guys, Leo, because spirits are in your favor. Spirits are helping you behind the scenes. Ooh, thank you, spirit. Underneath. Okay, see, underneath this card, this oracle card came out next, underneath to clarify this card, this card came out next. This is how I'm doing it, okay, guys? So this card says no more rain. And this card says no rain today, actually, okay? So th this is telling me is that whatever you guys put your what, whatever you guys put your mind to and your effort to, it's going to be a win-win outcome. Because you guys have changed your perspective. You guys have changed your out outlook on life. You guys have changed your plans, your mind. You guys have shifted into another consciousness. You guys are awakening to the truth. You guys are speaking to your spirit guides. You guys are having transformations. So there's no longer no more rain today. You guys have shifted your energies. You guys are on higher vibrations right now. Good job, Leo. Mm, beautiful messages, spirit. Okay. So your next oracle message, Leo. It says, conclusions are within reach. Full moon eclipse. Mm, I like this card because this card is telling you that your conclusions are within reach. Whatever you're trying to, whatever you're trying to learn, whatever you're trying to master, whatever you're trying to figure out, whatever information you need, it's only within reach. You guys are about to uncover something, discover something. You guys are about to, you guys are just evolving. You guys are discovering truths about yourselves and your spirituality and your gifts. Yeah. All these conclusions are within reach. Because you guys are, are, are expanding your higher consciousness. You guys are looking beyond that veil. 
you guys are seeing everything for what it is. You guys are receiving all those conclusions are, are within reach, guys. This beautiful message. Thank you, spirit. Underneath conclusions are within reach is this beautiful card. Touch the sky. Mm, I love this card because this card is just telling me that you guys are just, um, you guys are experiencing life like you never have. You guys are enjoying the little things of, in life. You guys are, uh, are just connecting with nature right now. You guys are very intuitive right now, very humble right now, and just grateful right now for all the blessings that you guys have. You guys are awakening to this. You guys are awakening to who you really are. So yeah, your your conclusions are within reach because you're just you're just here touching the sky. Like you're just connecting with your universal guides and energies and you're just loving that. You're just like really connected and in tune right now, raising your vibrations. Like you could touch the sky. Mmm, beautiful message. I love it. And this one, the energy is gaining momentum. Mm hmm The energy is gaining momentum. That's telling me that you guys are raising your vibrations, that your energy is on a new level. Mmm, I just heard that. Thank you, spirit. You guys are on a new level. I'm on a new level. I'm on a new level. Yeah, Leos, you guys are on a new level. Can't make it up. I just heard that song, too. That's funny. Yeah, you guys are on a whole new level, guys. Yup. Your energy is gaining momentum. I love this card. Just keep up the good work, guys. Keep meditating and keep healing and keep raising that vibration. Love it. And here, number number 28 card came underneath the gaining momentum. This one came out. Can you hear me? Ooh, these messages are on point. Because you are asking your spirit guides and angels, can you hear me? You guys are reflecting. You guys are meditating. Some of you are going near water. Some of you are manifesting with water. Ooh, beautiful. Yeah. Some of you are just really, really in tune with yourselves right now. And you're speaking to your guides and your spirit's energies. And you're, at, and you're wondering if they can hear you. Even some of you are speaking to past love family members that passed away. Yes, they can hear you. Your spirit guides and your ancestors, they definitely can hear you. They love you so much, Leo. And your energy is gaining momentum. These are some beautiful messages. I love these messages. Thank you, spirit. And let me pull some cards for you guys, Leo, and get some more energy and see what spirit guides have for you for this week. Like the tarot. Thank you, spirit. Beautiful spirit guides, give me some messages for the beautiful sign of Leo. Give me some beautiful messages and clarity for the upcoming week and the situation. Thank you, spirits. Ooh, these cards are slippery, guys. It's a brand new deck, so they're slippery. Spirit guides, angels, ancestors, universal energies, universal guides, please connect with me. Give me the messages for the sign of Leo. Give me the messages that the Leo needs to see here or no at this time. Please and thank you. Beautiful messages. Thank you, spirits. Mm, they want to talk, Leos. Okay, Leo, you guys are... Uh, let me see. Mm-hmm. Uh, Eight of Cups, Leo, okay? So you guys um, are trying to um, start something new. You guys are removing any blockages that are in your way right now. You guys are just like um, trying not to be too emotional at this time mm -hmm. because you guys are moving away from certain situations that weren't serving you guys, and that's what you're doing. You're, you're, you're deciding on which direction you're going to take and which way you're going to go because you guys are really... Not all of you guys, this is male or female, Leo, but some of you guys are really transforming. You guys are just transforming. You guys are just evolving. You guys are seeing things for what they are. You guys are no longer resonating with everybody. So you guys are trying to make a decision of which way to go, which direction to go, and what um, you know, what new project you're going to start working on because you guys are just evolving beautifully. Yeah, and you guys have spiritual gifts. Mm hmm and you guys are not accepting anybody's offer at this time, Leo. You know, you guys could be having people trying to bring you offers of love or of something, or I don't know, but this card is telling me 
that someone is being rejected. Someone's offer is being rejected. Either you or the person that you're dealing with. Leo, someone's rejecting an offer. Or they rejected an offer. You guys are just... You guys are not accepting offers. You guys are moving. You guys are going somewhere else in a direction. That's what I keep hearing. Okay? And this is the Six of Pentacles. And what this tells me is that you you guys are um seeking help. People are, you know, someone's going to come and help you in your situation, Leo. Someone's going to come bring you some money reward or some help or some abundance. And they're just going to, someone's going to come and give you guys a hand or you guys are giving somebody else a hand with some money or some finance or some help. Okay, that's what that card is telling me. We'll get some more clear messages so we can put this together, guys, and see what's going on. Let's get some more messages, spirits, guides, and angels, universal energies, ancestors of the white light. Please give me some clarity and messages. What a beautiful sign of Leo. Give me the messages. Thank you. Give me some more messages for the beautiful sign of Leo's. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Leo. Let's see what spirit got for you guys here. So Leo's, yeah, Leo, you guys are feeling like the wounded warrior, you guys are letting go of all these burdens, all these swords in your bag, whatever betrayals you guys went through, whatever hurt you guys suffered, you guys are moving away, you guys are removing those blockages, you guys are not being, you guys are trying not to be too emotional, you guys are trying to ground yourself and heal, because this is how they, this is how you guys were left, Leo. You or your person that you're dealing with is a wounded warrior. You guys just been through enough betrayals. You just guys learned a lot of truth. You guys awakened. You guys removed your veil. You guys realized that you guys need to let these burdens go. Yeah, you guys are releasing the burdens. And some of you with the Hereford card, some of you are having a divorce. Some of you could be getting divorced and going to court. Some of you could be having divorce. Some of you could just be um, getting um information from a higher uh, like an institution or like a higher company or a business or um you guys are getting divorced some of you guys are getting divorced yeah and you guys could be dealing with a taurus because that's a the taurus energy on that hereford card yeah leo you guys are about to become the king of pentacles you guys are working on your finances right now you guys are gaining your pentacles you guys are in this king of pentacles energy or you guys could be dealing with a king of pentacles energy male or female king or queen of pentacles which could be virgo taurus or capricorn leo you could be dealing with this type of energy or this is you right now embodying the king of pentacles energy because you're about to get um your finances you're about to you know get a you guys are starting new new, new businesses new projects with other people gaining um better jobs and finance some of you guys are receiving inheritances or payouts and why i say this is because inheritance is yours card came out up here hey leo inheritance is yours came out and then it came out you will win right next to it good times coming and then there's this hair font card here could signify a judge this could signify a court making a decision to give you your payout your lawsuit your lump sum your it could be an inheritance like i said it's something that's owed to you but you guys are, um, right now you guys are like ten, letting go of your, of your burdens and your King of Pentacles energy. And you guys are receiving the Ten of Pentacles money rewards. Okay, Leo, so just keep up the hard work because your conclusions are within reach. You're about to be victorious. You're about to gain, gain this income, this money, and stability. And you guys are not going back to the past to what hurt you. You guys are moving forward. And I love this energy. You're awakening. And you guys are independent right now. And you're in your power. I love this beautiful me message for you guys and this energy. I hope you like this reading. I hope this resonated. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel, Leo. I upload for you guys every week. Till the next time I see you guys, love you. Namaste.